Okay, so let's, the plug is right here on the left side of the machine, right there. Oh, when we turn it on, let's see what lights up on the front, that middle one. Oh, it flashed green and then it flashed orange. Okay, set this down nice and gently. Oh, it's green again. See that? It's green. Okay, let's open this up and get this set up. Kind of not the easiest to open. Guess it takes some getting used to. Now, on this computer, if I'm not mistaken, the power button is on the side. It's the oddest thing. But this is a power symbol right here. So, <laughs> that's why I assume the power button is. Let's see. Asus. In search of incredible. Yep. I going for incredible, amazing, awesome. Needed to do everything the specs say. It's my first time powering it on. And make sure you subscribe. I got an open box for this. Um, um, and also, I'm going to do a follow-up to let you know after I've used it for a while how I like it. Okay, it's region and language wants to know. And I'll be plugging my information in. Okay, once I plug my information in, I'm going to put next. Okay, license term. Make sure you read all of this wonderful stuff. All of the license terms. And after you read all of this wonderful information, then you can hit I accept. Okay, and personalize. Oh, wow. So I want to pick that. Do I want to pick this? This? Which color you like? That? Yeah. Or that? No, it's too bright. That's too bright? There you go. Let's make sure it's picking up sharpness. So this screen really looks great. But I don't believe my device is really picking up this crisp picture. I'm trying to let y'all see as crisp a pink as it is. I mean, I'm still, I can look at it between my device and this. This kind of makes it like a light kind of a lighter pink but this is a rich pink on this screen and I might not be able to get this device to capture this and so I'm not able to capture the crispness I'm trying to to pick it up for you but this still is a haze and on my screen it's a richness so this is basically a setting up video but I'm not, it's, it's in no way with this device, I'm able to pick up how rich this pink looks on this screen. And I'm trying, I'm, I'm, I'm focusing, and even as I focus, and you can see the camera focuses, it still doesn't look as rich. So let me finish setting this up. You don't want to cover the sound up, just make sure you do it like that. Okay. Okay, name your PC if that's your thing, and hit next. Get online and pick and finish setting up a PC. Let me pick, let me pick a network, and I'll be right back. Okay, right here after you plug in your <laughs> Wi-Fi and your password. 
this is the next screen that com comes up is settings you got express settings you can do express or you can do customize I'm gonna use these express settings next you set up your account and this is probably going to be talking about that um, Microsoft account, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, and right here you just basically go in and sign in to your, um, your Microsoft account. Um, and you can sign it really easily. Um, hold on just a moment, I'm going to sign mine in. And I'll be right back. And when you set it up, it's going to ask you. It's going to, um, after you set it up, it's going to, you're basically going to have to confirm this. So make sure you have more than one device available because whatever you plug in, it's going to basically need to send you information to another device to verify. Now, one moment while I verify. Okay, and then once you plug in the email you're gonna get a code and you're gonna have to come and verify the code to verify that um I guess who you're who you say you are and I believe you have the option to register if you don't have a Microsoft code and you stand it up for the first time you do have the option to register but let me enter my code and I'll be right back okay it wants to copy your save. Oh, okay. It wants to copy your settings and Windows store apps from another PC. Okay, cool. This is the PCI <laughs> return. This is new. So if you have another computer that you got linked with that Microsoft, it's going to ask you, do you want to save a copy of your settings? And of course, I'm going to say yes because I was upset that that computer didn't do what it needed to do. So I'm going to click next for this. Okay. Now, um, it's finalizing <laughs> the settings and it's, oh, okay. Hi. We're setting things up for you. Okay. And give it a few moments. You can get new apps from the store. In just a few moments. It's turning purple. Well, now it's turning to deep pink. I just want to, now it's going into red. Now it's going into orange. I just wanted you to be able to see the richness of the colors, but it's still, like this is green. It's a rich green. Then it's going back into blue. Purple. Yeah, it's not going to pick up the same richness that I see. I'll just sit tight. Okay, and we're in. And, oh wow, this is so funny. This is an app from my other computer that I had put on that I took back. I had it for 15 days and it has my settings. Um, Atlanta. Oh, that is so funny. Okay, so we're in. Let me hit this one little button. Would that take me to a desktop? Like it did at the other computer? Because that's supposed to take you to the desktop. This is new, so I don't want to pretend like I know how to use this. Hmm. So this doesn't take you to the to the desktop like the other one? Hmm. What about this one <laughs> button on the side? What does this button do? Well, let's find out and see. Okay, guys, I'm in and I'm filling out the, looks like the register your item. And also, I got my little window to come up. 
I guess the first time you go in, let me see. That's how you're able to go in from this screen to, and you touch this button, and you go back to the other screen. That's what I was used to. I guess the first time doing it, and since I've been in with um, this other, <laughs> why did mean to touch that? <laughs> since I've been in, this is touch screen. I, I forget this is touch screen, so this is really different. So if you touch anything on here, it's like, okay, we're going in. <laughs> so this is kind of new for me. I want to go back to the desktop. Oh, but I have to get out of this app. And I'm not that familiar with how to do this. Yeah, so this is kind of kind of different for me okay now I'm back so yeah it's gonna it's gonna be a learning curve if you are not familiar with Windows 8 I'm familiar with Windows 7 I love Windows 7 and so this is new for me but this little button right here is gonna be your friend see that you go from here to here if you're a person that wants to touch this, I forget it's a touch screen, you can do that screen a lot. I'm going to register this. You can already see some little fingerprints. Right there. And so, this is the computer. I will come back. I don't know what this web storage version thing is. I will come back and let you know how I like this computer, how um, it's been working for me. Um, I was able to sync some of my old settings from the old laptop that I used for a couple of weeks um, with this setting that I already had set up. So that was pretty cool. And so this is the ASUS and just kind of look at it.